Although if I remember correctly, yesterday seemed pretty calm as well. And it ended up being extremely, extremely windy. We just went to Marine West or West Marine and bought a couple of doohickeys. <laughs> Still need to learn the lingo. I think one of them is called a Boom Bail. B-A-I-L. And we bought that today to replace the one that we broke yesterday. And we're gonna install that now. And Tuesday morning, we go back to Iowa to continue our work with the storm damage for at least another month, I would think. This sail is about almost probably twice the width of the one, that, the jib that we've been using. If I am correct, it's called a Genoa, but I'll have to Google it. But it's a lot wider, so it'll be used, I guess, when the wind's coming towards our back to move forward. So this isn't going to do us any good today, so we're going to go back to the jib we were using yesterday. as yesterday which is a little scary to me but we've got our jib sheet ready to go i mean our jib ready to go jib sheets are ready to go they're already going back here we didn't have that set up yesterday and so in the winds and the waves that we were in it was really hard to get all of this stuff set up so we're already starting off on a way better foot today we've got this thing set up properly and donovan installed another cleat back there on the boom or something i'm not sure what i'll have to ask him. and then the little screw that broke that's what broke yesterday and we went to west marine and got a sturdier one let's see how it works out we'll start with just the main set. take it easy today we're pointing towards the wind right now the blue blue is main red is chip the arrow. I want to keep the red tip of the arrow over me. That's my job right now. Okay. 
So we're keeping the red tip of the arrow. We want to point towards the wind while Donovan's putting the main sail up so that there's less wind knocking around the boom, I guess, while he's putting it up. And in the past, we've been putting the jib up first and then the main sail, and we need to do that backwards. We're not even gonna worry about the jib. We're gonna do things differently today and see. Can we put the keel down before he puts the main sail up? Okay, we got the keel down now. I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Put your video down. Okay. Get out of the way. Don't, don't try to hold it. Now, I know you're both concentrating, but notice how this sail is not pulling either you off bulk load. That's because I'm keeping it in the nose in the wind. That's absolutely critical. What's the matter? The sheet was tangled inside the handle. Don't raise yet. Tell me when you're ready to raise. I'm ready to raise. All right, so I've got to get them all in there. Look. All right. Boom is loose, guys. Donovan, you now have to stay in front of the mast if you can. And TT, you need to be able to shrink down and... That looks good, Donovan. Whatever you do there, in a way that you can bring it down quickly if we need to. Are you ready there? All right. Right. We're gonna just go mainsail for a little bit. So, you wanna stay there, Donald? Yeah, I'm fine. All right, TT, you'll come here. You wanna shut off the engine when I tell you. Donald, how does she shut off the engine? All right, so first we'll put it in here. Bring it down. Turn it up to the lower. Get in the way of my my sails because we're now sailing. Mm -hmm. All right, do you know how to raise the motor? Put that back in where it was. I'm not going to give it much spill. Do you know how to raise the engine? Should be dragging. You can leave it if you want to. It's just going to pose. No, I want you to just relax for a bit. We're All right, good. guys. We're good. This was, this was perfect. The only, the only thing here, obviously, the way and had tangled up. When we put it down, it was so windy. I'm not surprised. When we got to port yesterday, yeah. we should have unfurled and made sure everything was ready to go. Yeah, I didn't realize that was tangled up. But look, the sail looks much better today, babe. The sail looks awesome today. The sa sail looks really awesome today. It's hard to uh, it's hard to stand up on that well, mess. Tough conditions. You need to get your. If you want to Let me make sure we're not going into the port area because we should probably be. I'm lost, I've lost the turn. Let it flap. I'm letting all, see what I'm doing? Yeah. I, I don't want to have any pressure that we don't need. So I'm, I'm letting everything go. Okay. And we're not going to do anything until Donovan tells us that he's safe up front. Okay. Sorry, Donovan. I couldn't hold it in the wind. Hold on, not yet. Can you get the front there?
quiet on the boat. Other than TT jabbering away to the goddamn boat. You're gonna pull that rope all the way down. because then you can you can handle going up and down. I got it, I got it. See what I'm saying? Always, you gotta be able to use your hand that's closest to that. Right. Just because of the way it's designed, that'll help you when that's you're in the middle. That's why we wanna put the little strings right here. Do you, do you know why the little clamp is on the top and not on the bottom? No. Now you're losing your breath. More, 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 and down. Because it's supposed to be released the easy release. You wanna, if you're in trouble, you wanna release quick, it goes right. down. But it makes it hard to put up. But if your hand is closer, when you put your hand too far, like when you just came about, right. you have to use your teeth. Keep, keep your hand yeah. always a hand with a with a sheet closer to that. Yeah, I was using my teeth. I don't know what that means. He lifted my mouth to grab it. He he had to pull this. He went all the way here. Oh, I totally missed that. I'll okay. have to look back on the video and see if I got it. <laughs> I don't know why that would be a fatigue. You're doing what you needed to do as a beginner to get the boat to the right place. That's so, not anything to critique about. You don't have to actually be tilting like crazy. No, to go fast. It went fast. We've got the wind behind us, but it's fairly, fair, you know. So our sails are more open, so we're flatter. We're still doing 5.5. It doesn't feel like it. It doesn't, but we're cruising. I feel like it's going fast. So we need to, we do need to tighten the shroud a little bit, they said. Well, I don't want to forget that. Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. us 
Captain Dino is taking us in. You can see already where we're 